Oh, wait. <clears throat> oh, fuck. So I saved like the last, like a bit of hour or so, even if I may not have been playing for an hour. Uh, I just wanted to try and keep the recordings tightly knit. Because uh, like the first two uh, kind of suffered a little. Crazy. Just don't look down. Are you serious? Oh, she's scared of heights. Oh god. Oh no. Slow and easy. Nice and smooth. Smooth is best. You're okay. We got a way through. Oh, can I? Here. <clears throat> so I just wanted to try and keep the recordings at least much more consistent, or at least if you see a little bit of layover from a previous episode, then it's better than just kind of missing chunks and wondering how I got got somewhere, dealt with something. So far it's a brutal challenge, but I think it's pretty in line. I'll go check it out. Fuck. Stay with the girl. Crouch. Crouch. Him in the next room. So you can strangle the infected. That's interesting. So they're not dead. They're just kind of overtaken by a ravenous disease. You could choke them out, which means they still need water and food, I guess. Oh fuck! Infected, pretty easy to kill. Clickers take a bit more. I'd imagine the phase three. So phase three is the clickers. Phase two is just like, just like another just like sub spot between. 
regular infected and fucking uh Okay, so I'm still green though, and I have like a couple bullets. Bullets for that, and a couple bullets for the handgun. Not too bad. I thought the recycle thing was like an icon to interact with. The. Like, okay. Oh! <gasps> bottle! Let me take out a bottle. These things are helpful. So, something I think almost anyone could agree on, uh, even if you're not like a fan of this game, um, is that they nail the feeling of dread. Like these skyscrapers feel like ancient ruins from a lost civilization because they basically are. Um, like it takes something familiar that you think you would never like go without and then makes it like it's almost like visiting an alien planet. Oh, what's this? Oh <gasps> the other weapon. A stick. Or like a piece of plywood. What's this? A brick. Um I don't know why I can't carry both. Or why can't I get Tess to carry like a brick and I carry like a bottle? Oh, whatever. Gameplay because sessions is tied. It makes everything feel so old world. Like, just the apocalypse is the most depressing shit ever. Oh, can we move this? This is so loud. Uh, Tess? Tess, go. Right, yeah, on. stop fucking around, Tess. So far, I'm really liking this game. Doing all right. It's a brutal challenge, but like, I feel like games on like this kind of necessitate the need for playing it on the hardest. Because if you're going through on a breeze, wait, what? Did you find some? Patch yourself up. I'm good. I cannot patch myself up. I don't know what you're talking about, Tess. Crazy talk. It's crazy talk, Tess. Wow, that's a really long drop. It's possible to survive it, but you don't really want to risk. Do it. You don't really want to risk jumping down and not knowing if they're infected then or not. I'll be back. So earlier I said that I had the last was part two. And I will download that and play that when I'm done with this game, but I think there's still a lot of game left to this. I guess it's like a long game, but uh, I'm really excited to get there and I hope you guys uh, don't mind my commentary too much. Um, I kind of talk to myself a lot uh, whenever I'm gaming by myself, so like, I feel like that's not too far from what people do for walkthroughs, playthroughs. I have no idea where the fuck to go, I just jump down right here.
This is like so good looking that it's almost distracting. Because my brain is like. After we get back, we can take it easy for a little while. You won't take it easy. Hey, you're the one always going on about laying low. And you always brush me off. Well, I won't this time. I believe it when I see it. So, that's what I was saying. Um, my brain hyperfixates on so many details at once. Like, my brain is looking at the light of the flashlight, but it's also looking at the detail of the the concrete, the rusty V-bar, the light reflection off the wall. Basically, I'm taking everything in, and I'm, like, almost overwhelming myself, but kind of in a good way. Come, go through. Hmm. Fucking clicker. Hear that? I don't know why they don't whisper more often. I say this game is alien here in design. Like you kind of fuck, fucking clicker. I don't know where it's at. I don't even know if I can strangle it like a regular infected. There's a clicker in here somewhere. I heard it from way a while ago. Oh, what time is it? That's so up. That new time. Uh. Yes. Down here. Oh, what was that? <gasps> uh, savage? Or something? Hold on. I can make a shiv, I think. No, I can't. What the fuck was, what the fuck was that that I just picked up? Oh, it's a broken piece of glass. But if you have like a piece of fabric or something to make a grip, you can use that as like a makeshift shiv. And what's this dead guy? His sleeve, Firefly. <gasps> Molotov. Yep. These guys aren't doing well in or out of the city. I just hope there's someone alive to meet us at the drop off. Let's see. A call in a vague to make a Molotov, or a call in a vague to make a med kit. So it's like a. Oh, he said the his fist, Firefly. Oh, his arm. Okay, never mind. Well, he got killed, and there's clicker somewhere, so that's probably no good news. What's this? Map? No? Okay. Whoa, what's this? Dead guy. It's a note. Meet up with second Firefly team at Capitol Building. Hey, okay. Capitol Gold Dome. Girl, 5 foot 3, 14 years old, red hair. Okay. So quarantine zone. See? They're not our guys. Yeah, but they're out here looking for Ellie. Uh but he got caught in with some infected and by the sounds of it a clicker somewhere. Over there, see it? Shit. Almost out. Okay, Joel, you take point, I'll watch the room. No matter what, you stay right on his heels. Sure. You stay sharp. I got it. Shit. Okay. It's time to take 
inventory. There's so many of them. Oh no, oh no. Well, uh, that was the last of us. <laughs> no kidding. Uh, pushing a clicker is dangerous, turn me the weapon. <sighs> Fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I'm so... <laughs> I don't know what to do in this situation. Need a shiv to stop the killer clocker. So you cannot... Okay. That was just my question, if you could just choke him out, you have to get a weapon to kill them. <laughs> I do not. Alright, we're so dead. We're so dead. We're so fucking dead. I don't know what the fuck to do in this situation. <laughs> Oh my god, Tess. God damn it. Okay. Well, okay. Fuck. I think in this scenario, we're gonna have to just... This scenario, we're gonna have to sneak past somehow. I literally don't know where the fuck to go. There's a blind bull check you since of hearing an echolocation.
I don't know what the fuck to do in this situation. Hardened by hardened fungus, they're stunned when they're destroyed. Because I think past a certain point, the development just completely takes their eyes. Fuck. I think I was kind of onto something. Um, bark. <laughs> That's what they call it. Park. It's. I call it like a clicking call. Oh god, no 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 no, fuck. So that's like several clickers, that's like a whole group of clickers. Oh, fucking hell. 